When did you become so well known for predicting bubbles or thinking that the markets were out of kilter sometimes? Was that because of your writings or because of your stock picking or your public speeches? 98, 99, of course, was a glorious, uh, a glorious bubble. And it just went up and up and up and up. And uh, we fought the bubble uh, all the way. So we were horrifically too early. That was a brutal two years, and the earnings were rising as well. So the market made a magnificent move from its all-time high in early 98, went straight up until March of 2000. And, uh, and our clients did not approve of us being early and uh, to a very considerable degree fired us. So people pulled money out, and then when the market finally did have its collapse, the so-called dot-com bubble burst, did people call you up and say, we're sorry, can we give you our money now? Not a single solitary person who fired us uh, came back uh, for the same product that they fired us for. Personnel changed, they inadvertently came back years later, but no one came back. We didn't lose money in 2000, we didn't lose money in 2001, and we did not, by the skin of our teeth, lose money in 2002. So by the time the S&P was down 50%, we had had three up years.